Hello everyone, I'm Rhino Clavin with your Diz Daily Fix for Thursday, May 17th, 2018, and here's what's happening today. It's a little dark in here because it's very cloudy. It's another rainy day today. I'll get to that in the weather section though. So first up, CNBC has announced that the popular game show Deal or No Deal will be returning with 30 all new episodes. And the reason why I'm talking about this is because they're gonna be filming them at Universal Orlando Resort. Now the original Deal or No Deal ran for four seasons from 2005 to 2009 and had host Howie Mandel lead contestants through a decision-making gauntlet in which they decided between multiple numbered briefcases using statistics to search for each, uh, for the one briefcase containing a million dollars. During the course of the show, the mysterious banker would offer deals to purchase a contestant's brief a briefcase based on the odds. We all remember the show. Um, the series is holding open casting calls for new contestants at Universal City Walk and throughout Florida. Um, so during the taping, guests at Universal Orlando Resort will also have the opportunity to become members of the studio audience, which is pretty cool. Um, no locations or recording schedules have been announced yet. However, casting is underway. So if you want to check out that full casting call schedule, visit universal.wdwinfo.com for more information and check that out and let us know if you get on the show. That would be pretty awesome. Um, and best of luck if you do. Now, next up, Disney Cruise Line has just announced some new departure dates and itineraries for the fall of 2019, um, featuring cruises through Bermuda, Canada, Mexico, the Bahamas, and Caribbean, as well as some more locations. Now, advanced booking will be available for Platinum, Gold, and Silver Castaway Club members, as well as Golden Oaks residents, Disney Vacation Club members, and Adventures by Disney Insiders. Now, those advanced booking dates for fall 2019 cruises are going to be starting on May 21st. If you want to see the full schedule of when you're available and able to book these cruises you can head over to www.info.com for that information or you can go over to dreamsunlimitedtravel.com where you can speak with a dreams unlimited travel travel agent who can help you with a no obligation quote to get started on your next disney vacation today Ding. Um, now, finally, starting May 18th, which is tomorrow, this Friday, uh, SeaWorld Orlando will be serving free beer to guests during Fridays for the summer season. Um, so that's between 10.30 a.m. and one hour before park closes, Mama's Pretzel Kitchen Patio will offer up to two 7-ounce beers for free. Guests can choose from, you know, it's pretty fancy here, Bud Light, Coors Light, Miller Light, or SeaWorld's Mako Red Ale. Um, in addition to the Friday offer, SeaWorld will host daily happy hours starting at 4 p.m. where visitors can enjoy food and drink deals. Um, the free beer promotion will continue until August 31st, um, giving visitors a total of 16 Fridays to take advantage of this. So if you're one of the 15 people that still go to SeaWorld, you know, definitely make sure to take advantage of this offer. Now, over on the Diz Today, our featured article comes from Nicholas O'Kelly titled Convincing Your Family to Get Out of the Box at Disney. Um, this is a pretty good article for people who find that their families are kind of stuck in the habits of doing the same exact things on every single visit. Um, so check it out. See what see what Nicholas has to say over there at www.info.com where you can find that article and many other great ones. Just making up words left and right today. Um, now, trending on the board today is a thread titled Avoiding Characters at a Character Restaurant uh, that was started by poster Tired Mom 4 on the Disney Restaurants Forum. Um, in the thread, she explains that her two-year-old is fairly timid, but her older child wants to eat breakfast at a restaurant that has characters present in the morning. She wonders if there's a way to let the characters know to skip their table or how other guests would handle the situation with a young child who might be scared. Uh, probably some pretty helpful information out there. Over, uh, Head over to disboards.com. You can read more about that. Share your strategies on how to navigate those waters. Now, it is Thursday, which means there's a new episode of the Dis Unplugged Universal Edition. Um, and in this week's episode, host Craig Williams, Craig Williams and myself are going to be giving you our feelings on Fast and Furious Supercharged, uh, Universal Studios Florida's newest attraction. Now that we've had some time to process it and we're not standing right in front of the attraction at a media event. So we're also going to be talking about some other stuff, some fun news in there. So check that out in all the usual places on iTunes, where I'm sure you're all subscribed, on youtube.com slash disunplugged, where I'm sure you're all subscribed. Got to get to those 100,000 subscribers. And then, of course, disunplugged.com. Now, finally, everyone's favorite part of the show, the weather. Uh, out in Anaheim today, tomorrow, I'm pretty jealous. It looks like beautiful theme park weather, perfect temperatures, right at 70 degrees both days, lows just around 60, absolutely beautiful. 
beautiful. Uh, here in Orlando, unfortunately, we've begun our rainy uh, the rainy season, and I think this week is the turning point on that. So the rainy weather continues today and tomorrow with thunderstorms in the forecast over the next few days with temps just over 80 today and tomorrow, and the lows just around 70. So make sure you bring in that umbrella, and please, 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 if you are driving off property, be careful with all the construction that's going on around Central Florida. There is a lot of unexpected flooding because of the lack of retention ponds and the new paved areas. So I drove through a pond last night to get home. Um, so yeah, for links to everything that was discussed in today's Diz Daily Fix, you can visit the Daily Fix main page at wdwinfo.com slash daily fix. That is going to do it for me today. I'm going to go head into a park now before the skies open up. I'll see you all later. Have a great day, everyone.